sponsors and their, and their beneficiaries. Uh, thank you for coming to the launch of Tumba's Christmas One Dog Annual 2012, which marks the 10th anniversary uh, for this event. Uh, we're uh, really excited uh, about staging this event again this year, and uh, our, our mayor will uh, touch on some of the points about this year and uh, what he misses out, I'll pick up at the end. So. <laughs> but uh, welcome to you all again, and thanks for coming, and I'd uh, like to hand over to our mayor. But, uh, now we celebrate, this time we celebrate 10 years of the moving of the, the, the lights into, uh, into our beautiful, iconic uh, Queen's Park. And of course the main movers behind it, not only the Birthday family, but can I also recognise the tremendous contribution of the Lions Club of West Toowoomba and the wonderful work that they've done. They Last year saw some 55,000 people attend and raised $75,000 with some special charities and some special people. And I've got no doubt that the way things have been happening this year, with everything that's happened in this region, Carnival of Flowers, you know, Camp Oven Festivals, I went to Little Parangia, which has a population of 50, to see 3,000 odd people back in town for the day. There was a squeeze, I can promise you. So numbers are up. People are wanting to celebrate special things this year. And I'm sure that this will be one of those great uh, things that will happen this year. There are many volunteers that are needed. You need something like 36 volunteers per evening to run, run this wonderful event. And of course the word is spreading that there's a need for volunteers to help. Uh, the Lions Club can't do it all, so we need many groups of people to help. Also I want to thank the volunteers, the choirs, the singers, the bands. And there's a total of 31 groups and, so, and soloists to contribute to that so much. So, uh, ladies and gentlemen, it's my absolute pleasure to uh, uh, to, met, to launch the uh, 2012 Christmas Wonderland of Lights, and thank you all for your attendance today. Uh, thanks, Paul, for, for those, uh, those words, and uh, I wish to acknowledge the contribution that uh, the Toowoomba Regional Council also makes to this event. Uh, without the uh, the use of the botanical gardens and the support of uh, council staff, particularly the, the garden guys up in uh, Queen's Park. Uh, I don't think the event would be the spectacular that it is if it wasn't in that location. So thank you all to you and your team and uh, uh, we look forward to your continuing support for this event. Uh, if you belong to an organisation that would like to come along and, and volunteer during the day, just turn up, bring your lunch. But if you wish to volunteer at night time, you must do that by registering on our website. We've got some uh, cards around there which has got the website on it. You just click on the volunteers register and pop your name in there and uh, we'd love to see you on the night time. Uh, that ends the official part of this morning, but please stay and, and have a chat to uh, the other sponsors, to, uh, to council members and also to some of our lines. Not you, George. Um, <laughs> And, 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 and please join us in some morning tea, which, which has been generously provided by the uh, regional council. Thank you very much for coming, and uh, we'll see you at the lights.